so i hope it will be clear to you like what are the some minor problems yeah and hardly six sir, minutes uh, can be easy yes 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 please sir, uh, last year i appeared in the ielts exam and i got six uh, band in speaking mm. uh, i think i am on the same level and the same level is only because of one minor reason right honestly i just give this band i didn't like uh, rise your score like because it, it would help you uh, in knowing your level well right and the same level doesn't mean that you didn't uh, like did you didn't uh, go through some progress etc uh, you are having in a progress condition right now and you also answered in a very good like in a prolonged way but the band which i give for the purpose like the some mine some of the minor mistakes if you would work on those mistakes and those uh, minor problems you can easily achieve seven plus even right like you have guts even some students face difficulty in prolonging the answer so you are far more better than those students like you are able to prolong an answer you can share a lot of ideas that minor mistakes can be called tense conditionals and subject verb agreement just do on these three topics um, a little bit more practice and also if you would just add some po more positive uh, points in your speaking like uh, connectors and also synonyms these things are going to help you a lot 100% to make your uh, uh, answers are to make it more perfect etc right so that's why i ate such points right is it clear yeah and uh, the, the, the yes, if you sir, if you I, think uh, like, i am in yes sorry yes hello yes your voice is not clear sir i felt nervousness in front of examiner how to yeah. avoid this situation this 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 nervousness would be fulfilled to not feel it just like when you become able and when you feel confident in for in front of the instructor or any other senior person who takes your mock exam or uh, like who is senior to you or like your friends or anyone else your teacher etc in front of whom when you feel confident you can also feel confident in front of examiner as well but uh, it also depends on your you can say uh pre preparation if your preparation would be done very well so you would also be able to perform 100 percent perfectly okay yeah uh, the, the the mistakes okay, are not sir. major right these are minor and why i say it minor because that can be even covered in seven to ten days but if you work with consistency hopefully right okay, okay. yeah sir, okay. Uh, what do you uh, advise me uh, on daily basis what can i do uh, go through uh, uh, yeah go through uh easy works on daily basis like uh also doing practice and at the same times take choose one of the gra grammar topics like on this day i have to focus 100 percent on the tenses and uh, beside tenses also how to use connectors like first first task for first three four five days or even six seven days right and then after tenses like tenses are 12 right so to cover all the tenses like to cover in a sense to answer in the same tense right to examiner and we said that um, uh, go for then after tenses uh, the the conditionals four conditional types and uh, conditionals are very easy easiest topic right and uh, after conditionals go for subject verb agreement topic and then if you can add Sir, conditional, uh, yes. what do you mean by conditional conditional the if when condition sentences who we uh, like those shows uh, the conditions right uh, like if, if examiner use would could are other model verbs and he ask you any condition like if it happened or when it ha it would happen right when it would and could when all these model verbs are going to be used by an examiner you are supposed to answer in the same model by using the same model verbs right to answer in the same condition whatever the condition is used by an examiner right, right? Uh, yes uh, uh, for example uh, give us a, a question a question example and answer of that question yes like uh, the question was do you think it would be now do you think it would be this is condition it would be more enjoyable to go swimming outdoors or indoors right you answer there are uh, uh, the, the, uh, I, 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 I don't i didn't remember the further answer but how you answer 
the, the, the helping words which you use so far were related to present simple tense. Why the examiner asks you the condition regarding it would be more uh, enjoyable like regarding yes, the future. Yes. Yeah. So you should also use same it would be. Yes, it would be more enjoyable. Yes, or it would be not enjoyable. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Got it. Got it. Uh, it, it is easy. It is very easy. Yeah, but uh, students the are question, supposed... question is in, question is in uh, future uh, and I, uh, I also yeah. use in future. Uh, it would be yes. whatever the than... condition or tense is actually uh, students know the uh, everyone knows like the, is, is, uh, the, uh, what tense is this and what uh, condition, but they face the difficulty or problem because of lacking practice, right? So just at the same time, do more practice or for at least seven or, and maximum. 10, 12 days, right? You can cover all these topics along with, uh, you can see uh, like every minor mistakes even, inshallah, right? Inshallah. Okay. Right, sir. Yes, you. very good, very good. All right, uh, I would like to ask question from Fatma because uh, the other Razia, Razia is missing. So Fatma, you can, uh, are you here Fatma? And ready? Yes, sir. Okay, all right. Let me... What is your full name, please? Yeah, uh, my name is uh, Keshani Kaushalya. You just can call me as Kaushalya. Mm, all right. Okay. Uh, may I see your identity card? Yes, sure. Here it is. All right, this is your ID card and your picture is not visible. All right. Okay. Yes. Uh, where do you live? Uh, yeah, I'm living in uh, Kandy, which is one of the best glamorous city in uh, Sri Lanka, uh, located in the center of Sri, uh, Sri Lanka. And I was born and bred in there, and I have been 25 years there. Good. good. Do you work or study? Yeah, currently I'm working as a lecturer in the University of Colombo, and it's gave me a great self sense of satisfaction to while teaching to the students as well. All right, your questions are related to jewelry uh, from part first, the remaining four questions. How often do you wear jewelry? Oh, obviously, uh, uh, to be begin by the answering, uh, usually, uh, you know, about, uh, as a girl, uh, we are keen on to wear the jewelry as well. So uh, same as uh, I usually wear when I go outside, uh, I usually wear the jewelers as well as the gold jewelers i usually prefer to wear all the time yeah very good what type of jewelry do you like best mm, yeah obviously that's a mm, very good question to me uh mm, yeah you know what uh, i really passionate about to have the gold jewelers uh and to have that um as well as uh, I, yes. I hope to give me a great. Yes, yes, yes. Your mic is muted. I think you got busy or something happened. Are you here, Fatma? Yes, please. All right. Okay. Yes, uh, Salma, are you here? Yes, sir, I'm here. Okay, I'm going to ask you a question, but meanwhile, let me confirm from Fatma. Fatma, are you able to answer for further question right now? Yeah, yes, sure, okay. Yes, okay. Uh, okay. Have you ever given jewelry to someone as a gift? Um, yeah, well, obviously, I uh, the drawing attention to the matter of fact that uh, I gave the jewelers uh, mm, to my one of the best friend. Actually, at the, the meantime, uh, she has the birthday as a birthday gift. You know what? Uh, it's not the same as the special gift, but beside that, it's giving a uh, uh, his great sense of satisfaction with having the unbelievable uh, surprises. Very good, very good. Coming towards part two question. Describe an interesting TV program you watched about a science topic. 
Describe an interesting TV program you watched about a science topic. You should say what science topic this TV program was about. When you saw this TV program, what you learned from this TV program about a science topic? Yes, you have one minute. Okay. Okay. Yes, your time begins now. Yes, Fatma, are you here? Yes, yes. Yes. Mm, yeah, um, I talked to you. Mm. Okay, first of all, thanks for giving me this such an amazing topic to talk about. Uh, the main uh, scientific uh, scientific uh, advertisement uh, which I uh, seen in my life actually is uh, none other than the uh, uh, al uh, alcohol, uh, alcoholic advertisement uh, which is that uh, prohibited uh, when I uh, when is uh, um, uh, well I guess I could start by answering uh, what uh, kind of actually uh, when is my mind is going through the right path, I have remember one of the actor, actors uh, performed to that advertisement while saying uh, that the uh, kind of the bad impression, the liquor kind of the um, kind that mean the cola advertisement, it's, uh, she's mentioned as it's uh, giving the good, uh, better health for all kind of children's as well actually it's a uh, you know what uh, most of the children are following for the elders and the celebrities because of that due to that uh, most children's are uh, following and keen on to buy kind of uh, bad habitual things like etc so uh, finally the government have prohibited and they banned that advertisements as well um, due to that, um, uh, when is the furthermore the drawing attention to the matter of fact that the when I see uh, actually it's kind of uh, uh, so my mind is going either through the recently uh, it's posted that mean uh, recently uh, actually it's gained me uh, I think it's uh, giving the bad impact to the social media as well as the uh, society as well. Um, at the end of, uh, finally cut the long story to the short, my uh, very last point I need to mention in here, um, as the government and the, as the uh, parents should have to be allocated for a good uh, ban for that bad, bad kind of uh, advertisement to prohibit, make the prohibited because due to the, they need to, uh, protect the children and their youngest teens as well. Due to the fact that I mentioned the uh, advertisements giving, giving us the, so, so many uh, wide varieties of the good qualities as well, but indeed that they are giving uh, so many uh, other bad uh, demerits as well. So uh, I believe, uh, however, I believe government and the uh, parents also have the responsibility to do, uh, maintain this. Because of these reasons, I prefer the the main uh, thing we have to concern to um, uh, to protect the youngest teen and also youngest teen using this uh, kind of advertisement. Yeah, thank you.
Very good, very good, perfect. Yes, uh, very good. All right, now question from part three, moving to our part three. Questions are again related to science in the public. The first question, how interested are most pop, uh, sorry, how interested are most people in your country in science? Uh, well, obviously, uh, there is no shadow doubt. Uh, most of the youngest teens uh, probably uh, they willing to have the, uh, uh, you know, what kind of social impressions are uh, using the kind of uh, social business as well, due to the fact that most of the um, uh, youth uh, uh, they are passionate about and they are following and. Uh, uh, they captivated with this using that advertisements as well. You that I believe that uh, most probably uh, using the clothes and dressing as well, and the uh, kind of uh, fast food and kind of uh, some kind of things they fashionate and they following using that uh, broadcast things and advertising and and words um, due to the fact that they having kind of a bad bad impression and the bad health delay because of their followed having uh, so many uh, fast food due to their hectic lifestyles. So I believe that's uh, not uh, much good at all, uh, but uh, my, in my point of view, but I guess it's uh, uh, due to this current situation, that is the same scenario, yeah. All right, okay. Yes, uh, very good. All right, the next question for you is, why do you think children today might be better at science than their parents? Yeah. Um, yeah well, uh, to be honest with you, um, the youth, that means the child, uh, youngest teen should have to uh, science uh, you more priority uh, to be uh, uh, um, obey to their parents as well. And uh, they, they want to choose the good things from the bad. And uh, when we uh, consider about the uh, good and uh, uh, science, uh, just can you face this question, sir? Science? Just five seconds. Is the question is sorry for the little bit distraction. This question, the question is uh, how how do you sorry why do you think children today might be better at science? than their parents. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, uh, mm, yeah, well, uh, to be uh, honest with you, uh, mm, the when considering the matter of fact that the more due uh, mm, to the hectic lifestyle uh, in this modern era, most of the students are uh, that means children are uh, concerning about the science and the that the deepest thing in their life, but they not going to much uh, much into listen to parents as well. But uh, they are almost going to be follow kind of uh, new general new things, and uh, they try to innovate ideas, and they try to uh, abstract, and they try uh, they are passionate about to. Um, uh, have some kind of experience regarding new things and all, but they are beside that listening to parents and obeying to parents as well. But the thing is, I um, want to make it clear is that the, as the parents and uh, parents have the responsibility to take care of the children and they want to give kind of uh, uh, motivate you and the, um, strict they, them in the right path. That's the thing I want to make it clear is that. Thank you. Very good. Very good. The next question for you is, how do you suggest the public can learn more about scientific developments? 
Yeah, uh, yeah, well, uh, to be honest with you, uh, this is the great sense of satisfaction the patient. The government and the uh, society should have the so vital uh, 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 responsibility to hand off these patients in the proper way. Why I say that uh, due to the fact that because uh, uh, the God, ch younger students and the childhood, you know, uh, they are try to uh, take experience from the new things, yeah, because of the due to the advertisements and the all new uh, uh, possible things uh, due to some kind of. Uh, uh, you know what kind of celebrities and they are following that but uh, in my point of view uh, as the children at the youngest team we have to uh, uh, make them in a proper guideline from the childhood even at the school syllabus even so as the government they have responsibility to maintain the proper guidance and view the good uh, group activities and in improve their intellectual skills without uh, consider rather than considering the studies and all Be uh, beside that they want to improve the intellectual skills and uh, uh, kind of group activities as well and also mention the uh, familiar bond and also uh, making some kind of uh, seminars or the improvement of programs and uh, experiment programs uh, to know the good things and they after that, they will have the good scientific and the uh, new generational and new technological devices. They want to be improve their life and want to give experience for that. Uh, that kind of things I can mention here to improve the to student science and the technology and the good behavior as well. Thank you. Very good. Okay. The last question for you is, do you agree or disagree that there are no more major scientific discoveries left to make? Uh, yeah, obviously, the matter of fact that um, uh, to begin by answering, um, uh, yeah, uh, most of time of the time they, uh, in you know what the in new generation, uh, most time they arrange then they uh, develop kind of technological devices and scientific uh, outcomes. But uh, rather than I, uh, I think uh, we want to be more and uh, in a good way actually. Uh, uh, however, I believe uh, uh, at the childhood even we have to give some uh, knowledge regarding the new techno technology. Beside that, while uh, teaching the history and kind of uh, uh, written parts, uh, beside the practical knowledge is very important. I have to mention in here critically importantly and uh, beside that uh, uh, other countries we have to move to the other countries and take some kind of knowledge regarding that uh, what are the new technologies and what are how can we improve that and kind of uh, these kind of things I can mention here is uh, this is the way indeed that uh, government and the society have the responsibility to uh, make it in the in good manner yeah thank you very good very good all right okay you uh, you done very well today your pronunciation the style of uh, uh, just speaking the accent i really appreciate the fluency was 100 percent perfect it was like the highest parents students and we said that only one thing only one thing uh, you use and repeatedly but it was also having a kind of uh, normal impression and to like uh, just bring a kind of more perfection and like more beautiful impression uh, you you are supposed to go for using some connectors to use some connectors like furthermore in addition additionally sir i would like to also mention right like these phrases and such connectors otherwise uh, the way you used and it was like having a kind of normal impression right not a bad impression and we said that your fluency was 100 percent perfect uh, the accent the style and uh, like it seemed really to me that you worked a lot and you did struggle uh, overall i would give you uh, the highest one in today's speaking module right would you like to know about that or not Yes, no, so okay, no. all right, I think not. Yes, so I, <laughs> 7 .5. No, I have to 7 .5. Yeah, you I are, 
yeah, you you want to practice. You need uh, seven point five because of uh not using connectors, right? Uh, further you used very good. You you are like far more better because of your hard work and struggle. I really appreciate it. Like the fluency and the accent are even going to impress a lot the examiner, right? Like the, how beautiful your fluency is. If you talk in such a way, it seems like the person is uh, just uh, like reading a note or just uh, delivering a kind of speech which he or she had already prepared so far. So it is, it is going to have a very uh, impressive and a good impression on an examiner, right? Okay, so just keep it up, keep it up by uh, all of you just keep uh, your level up by using more uh, connectors and also uh, like focus on yourselves where your grammatical mistakes lie so far. Work on those grammatical mistakes and we make them your strongest part. Yes, Salma, are you here? Sir, can I ask you a question, please? Sorry yes, yes, yes. for the disturbance. Yes. Uh, in part three, how much, uh, how, uh, for how many minutes should we talk? One one Any minute question? is maximum. One minute is maximum. Forty five seconds, thirty plus is re required. Thirty plus forty five seconds is enough. One minute is maximum, right? After one minute, examiner may stop you. Otherwise, you can say, because of such reason, I prefer. I agree with this decision, or I think that this is okay. Thank you, right? This is your indication to examiner that sir, I I have prolonged it enough. Please ask me another question, right? And if examiner asks the next question, to it is also fine, right? Like one minute maximum, thirty minutes, hundred percent minimum, forty five seconds average. Okay. So can I ask okay, thank you. Yes. Yes. Sorry. Yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, because of these reasons, I prefer this thing that phrase can be used uh, only for the part three, right? The part two, Q, part, the part one, we can't use it that because of the time slot is very less that uh, beside that uh, can use it in the part three, right? Also, we have to two, use it part you three. You are two. done with part two, two questions. Part yeah, yeah, yeah. As well, yeah. right? For the land Yeah, phase. finally, we are, yeah, finally, we are mentioned, however, we are mentioned, no, at, yeah, okay, that part three, we have to use it, right? Yes, yes, yeah, very good, you. very good. Okay, yes, now I would like to move towards Salma. Salma, are you here? Yes, sir, I'm here. Okay, what is your full name? My full name is Salma Nas, and you call me Salma. Salma, very good, very good. Uh, may I see your ID card, please? Yes, sir. Of course, this is all right. You solved the question or not? Okay, yeah, this is your ID card. Thank you. All right. Do you work or study? Uh, sir, currently I am working in a high school. All right. Where do you live? I live in Jhelum. That is uh, the smallest city of Pakistan. It is also a historical city. Very good, very good. This is enough regarding place, okay? All right. Now, uh, like the, the information uh, regarding place is enough. It, it shouldn't be in much deepness. This is okay. Yes. Uh, now, let's talk about some flowers and plants. Do you have a favorite flower or plant? Yes, sir. Uh, I have so many flowers in my house, but the most uh, favorite one is uh, roses. And... Uh, I have uh, different uh, colors of roses, plants in my lawn, in my garden, and uh, I water them daily. And uh, in in the spring, there uh, in the spring, most of the flowers are at bloom, but flower roses are at the best because uh, of their fragrance, because of their colors, their shape, everything is perfect. I love the roses. Very good, very good. All right. What kinds of flower and plants grow near where you live? Um, sir, in my hometown, uh, the the place is very uh, productive, and uh, very uh, there is so much greenery all around. And uh, in around my uh, house, there are so many plants, uh, regular uh, regular plants, for example, flowering plants and uh, uh, trees. Mm, such as uh, uh, mango trees and uh, um, lemon tree, lemon plants. These are growing in, inside uh, inside the houses, but outside there are different uh, uh, trees. Perfect, perfect. Is it important to you to have flowers and plants in your home? Yes, sir. 
Yes, sir. I'm I'm very habitual to uh, get uh, plants. When I, wherever I see something new. Yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes. Sorry, sir. <laughs> yes. All right. Any new participant, I think, ask her to, like, let me also participate. Okay, yes. Um, uh, I would like to ask the, yes, who else is here? Naveed, Naveed Ulhas, Esan, I think you didn't participate. Yeah, so uh, I uh, recently joined the meeting. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, I'm directly asking, going to ask question from you. What is your full name, please? Sir, my full name is Naveed Hassan. You can call me Naveed. Very good. All right. Uh, do you, uh, may I see your identity card, please? Yeah, yes, you can see this. Okay. This is yes. Yes, all right. You can switch on your camera as well to see you also in the real. All right. Do you work or study? Sir, uh, I'm uh, working and also studying in uh, Punjab University mm -hmm. as a lecturer. Of yes. chemistry very good very good perfect all right now yes um where do you live so uh currently i'm living in lahore but i uh, belong to uh dera ghazi khan which is the remote area of uh, province punjab all right okay let's talk about some study and work who do you spend most time working with or studying with Sir, I uh, I spend most of the time with my students for uh, uh, working and also studying with them to uh, enhance their uh, knowledge and also their uh, critical skills and uh, their research methodology, especially yes. in the field of science. Very good, very good. All right. Okay. Are there times when you study better by yourself? Sorry, sir, please paraphrase your question. Is there any convenient time where you feel like this is very good time for you to study? Yeah, I think it's most appropriate time for me to study, uh, especially in uh, higher education, uh, as I'm doing PhD in mm -hmm. chemistry. So it is most appropriate time for me because I am uh, uh, know about uh, the basic knowledge of my subject. That's why I can explore it in a in a in a practical and more uh, logical way. Very good, very good, perfect. All right. Next question for you: Is it important to like the people you study with? Yeah, it, it is important to uh, uh, study with the people who I'm like, uh, because uh, when you studying with that with that kind of people, uh, which you like, uh, do uh, you always feel compatible with them? Yes, 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 yes. The question was, do you like people? Sorry, is it important to like the people you study with? Right. The question was like this. It is important to like the people you study with, okay? But and you know, like the yeah, question, yeah. yeah, the answer was a little bit uh, not having a kind of relation with the question. Is it important or not to like people or dislike people with whom you study? Yes, okay. And you now part two question coming towards part two. Describe a tourist attraction you enjoyed visiting. You should say what this tourist attraction is, when and why you visited it, what you did there. Yeah, so uh, when I was uh, in uh, Kadiazam University during my postgraduate studies, at that time uh, we arranged a tour to uh, uh, our uh, city Lahore mm -hmm. because there are uh, so many people who didn't saw, see the Lahore at that time uh, because the, so many people who are studying in Kadiazam University were from uh, different provinces yes. and different area of the Pakistan 
who are basically not belonging to Lahore. That's why they can they didn't see Lahore at that time. We arranged the tour for them, and uh, when uh, we first decided to uh, we go to Lahore, so many people are objecting because they didn't know uh, about the historical places and the diversity of Lahore. Uh, that's why they are uh, objecting our idea. But when they uh, came with us to uh, see, to saw the different places and different historical places and food items of Lahore, they really enjoyed it. And they always remember when we came back to our university. And uh, here in Lahore, we uh, uh, arrange uh, uh, so many different uh, food items for them uh, to uh, give them an idea about the uh, diversity of food uh, in uh, our city and they are uh, always praise uh, our uh, food stuff of our city very good very good overall it was quite good but uh, the only problem at here was uh, a little bit also in fluency fluency was also like not not bad but it will it can it should be improved and little bit tense problem was also there tense problem in a way that uh, they, uh, they uh, like uh, to after preposition to this is called in, infinitive verb infinitive phrase when you use uh, any verb after preposition to like to see uh, you mentioned to saw after preposition to in writing all of the students should keep yeah. it in mind that after two we use first form yeah. of verb not ing or second form of verb right but this is also That's i hard. think i hope you would have the knowledge regarding this but the problem maybe occurred because of it. lacking uh, like lacking practice right yeah. uh, try to do it on daily basis yeah. like uh, uh, choose any of the participants yeah, and try best. daily uh, do conversation with the person overall uh, you can easily achieve uh, plus 6.5 you can easily achieve with this with this kind of answer right the way you answer so far right uh, with this kind so of can i get uh, 6.5 more than 6.5 uh, with this fluency, fluency? you can easily achieve 6.5 with this fluency and with this and if you just work further for 8 to 10 days with consistency then you can also rise it to 7 and 7 plus right otherwise 6.5 can be achieved by this fluency and by this kind of one. Beside that, your tense is uh, yeah, compared to all other students. You use tenses very correctly, and uh, yeah, there were some some two or three minor mistakes. Yeah, happened just accidentally or randomly. But overall, your tense were tenses using were very perfect. That was perfect. I really appreciate it. Very good. Yes. Sir, yes. 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 Sir, actually, I'm coming from uh, uh, from bazaar. And when I came to yeah. hostel, I saw your link and uh, uh, abruptly I joined it and no, started no, no. speaking with you. We visited, That's we right. also visited and we yeah. also saw, yeah, yeah, along with your yeah. answer as well, the, your bazaar as well. You also yeah. shown it to us. Okay, thank you for this. Okay, so it was all regarding today's session. Thank and you. if anyone is having any query, any question, they can ask me and the uh, uh, you can see and the private chat documents group are in the concern group okay thank you so much thank you see you all it was a very nice session see you all sir i have a question documents um, please the time is ended time is ended